Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today I'm going to take you back to the City Shaper table for mission number 10, the steel construction. Woo! That is a doozy of a mission for 20 points. If you want to see that, stay with me. And after watching this video, if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right there. Come on, I know you can do it. Okay guys, so again, throwing out the disclaimer. If you don't wanna see this mission, please don't watch. I'm just trying to show teams that are trying to figure out and wrap their head around how this gets done. Uh, but I'm definitely not saying do it this way. I'm just showing you possible options. This mission, steel construction number 10, it was very painstaking. It was very brain frying um, just because it's so far, just because of the dynamics of how that steel construction stands up and it twists and everything like that. It was a very difficult mission, I'm not gonna lie. In fact, when I tried to figure this out, I definitely had to go to a two-part series on how to get this done. So I'm gonna do one part and then come back to home and then actually go back again to try to get this thing to stand up. So if you want to see that, come on. Okay, everybody. So the first part about this is my goal is to take this white unit and basically lift up the steel construction and push this underneath it to kind of just elevate it. And then the plan is to come back to base or home and then to go back and lift it up the rest of the way. So watch this. It's a cool little space under here for the in the educator bot slides right in there and let's go ahead and uh, go over there and slide that under the steel construction oh don't you hate it when you can't find the program you were on okay so here we go I put the uh, bigger part in the front just because I knew I wanted to keep this up. Let's lift it up. There we go. And we'll just watch that robot head over there to home. Yeah, I think he's safely in there. What do you think? Okay, so now we have this lifted here so now we'll just come back and hopefully lift it up so that it can stand up oh yeah all right, it's standing up, and I put that back up at the end just so that I knew that this robot was not gonna be holding it up. And nope, I didn't wanna put any kind of backup on this one here. We'll just take the 20 points and make this one of our, you know, a mission we're not gonna come back for. So, woo, this was tough enough just getting it to be like that, let alone have to come back from that. So, this one, Wow, this one took so much effort. Um, so this is the second part where we first had to put that unit underneath it. And then the second part was just to come back and lift it up. So, wow, I would consider this and the elevated places whew, probably the two toughest on here. Why don't we just make these both 100 points? What do you think? Okay, guys, so there you have it. Steel construction number 10. Woo! It was one of those jump up and down. No way did you know? Did that really happen? Um, just because there was just so many hours and trial and error and ah oh, frustration. This is not going to work. Let's build this. That's not going to work. So it was very gratifying to actually get this one done. Um, so again, twenty points for steel construction. I'm still trying to argue that this should be worth 120, but. For those teams that can do this, man, that's awesome. Kudos to you guys. Hopefully you're still having fun with City Shaper. Um, as things start to wrap up and your team gets, you know, your 
your playlist of what you're going to do. So best of luck to you guys. I am Mr. Hino from Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. I'm out. This is Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics coming from you from Disneyland. I'm out.